Davis police are asking community members to be aware as they investigate a series of indecent exposure and peeping incidents over the last week. We've had both. So we've actually had two separate indecent exposure incidents and two what we would call peeping um, incidents looking into a bedroom window of the house. At this time, police say they believe the suspect is in his mid-20s with facial hair and glasses and wears a hooded jacket and ski mask when he approaches women. They've been all involved female victims um, on sidewalks or parking lots. The incidents have been near West Covell Boulevard, including on F Street, Alvarado Avenue and Anderson Road. Police say the most recent incident occurred near Acacia Lane. I hadn't heard about those incidents, but it's pretty troubling. John Keller lives nearby. Definitely, we would like to have people be aware of problems in the neighborhood and keep an eye out so they don't continue. Police say each incident occurred around midnight. Last year, Davis police alerted community members to a series of similar incidents in the summer and fall of 2023. The locations of the reports and the suspect description, they say, are very similar. We put a lot of officers on it. Um, there's a lot of extra patrols, a lot of saturation in the area. Our detectives work very hard to try and their best to identify someone. They say it's plausible this is the same guy. It's very possible. As they investigate, they're asking Davis to keep their eye out for anything suspicious. We're asking everybody to please be alert. Please be aware of your surroundings. And again, if you see anything that matches anything to do with this, please call us immediately. Time is of the essence because it allows our officers to get there quickly and at least try and find this person. Davis police again asking anyone with information about this investigation or who have experienced a similar incident to immediately contact the Davis Police Department. In the newsroom, Leon Denier, KCRA 3 News. All right, Leon, thank you.